those of us who are still breathing cannot repay the sacrifice of those who have given their lives defending us. But at least we can and we must remember them. Several dozen veterans and family members of veterans gathering at Laurel Grove Cemetery. Praise oh. um, To know that someone sacrificed their life, their life so that America could have freedom is, is a very important thing. And I think everyone should look at Memorial Day a lot differently than we do. A wreath laid at the foot of the flag as veterans say this day should always start with a tribute to the fallen. It's just a day for us to come together and honor those who didn't make it back. Um, one day set aside for the country to do it, but for those of us who had friends that died and the family members who had uh, loved ones that passed away, they remember those guys every day. The Savannah Veterans Council joined the American Legion William P. Jordan Post 500 in organizing this event. Missions may end, but the legacies last. Post Commander James Putney Jr. says it's not about a ceremony, it's about the lives lost. We continue to lose American heroes every day in military training, accidents, missions around the world. The loss to their families friends, fellow servicemen, and country is permanent. Ready, aim, fire! Remembering our fallen heroes once a year is not enough. Veterans just hope more people will remember every day. Just remember those that sacrificed for us because they died so we could be here. Joanne Merrigan, WSAV News 3, on your side.